Hey lovelies, welcome back to Simply Share Share. Now if you're new to the channel, welcome. This is the place to be when it comes to decor and DIY ideas and it's all about getting things done simply. I have done a lot of the holiday decorating in my home over the years and when it comes to wreaths, they can get really expensive. I went to the local grocery store and I wanted to pick up a fresh evergreen wreath and it was about $40 not including the decorations. The price tag can get even higher when you go to the home decor stores and they're not even real. Today I am challenging myself to create a gorgeous boho chic holiday wreath for under $25. So let's get started. I am loving the boho chic vibe this year and as you can tell with my Christmas tree and even my festive kimono, I thought I would take the boho vibe from the interior to the exterior, starting with my front door. Here's what you'll need. A faux wreath, two small bunches of evergreens. You could use anything like pine, juniper, cypress, just vary it up. Scissors, green wire, mini string lights. These gold ones have a really cool Moroccan vibe. Decorative birds, mini ornaments in gold, mini tassels, and a nice wide wire ribbon in gold. I wanna create lots and lots of texture, so I'm going to start off by using a faux evergreen wreath as my base. Start by fluffing the faux wreath stems to create some volume. Cut the evergreen needles off the branch into smaller pieces, and that's gonna add a nice fresh scent, plus a lot of depth. Then tie the green wire around the base of each evergreen stem. Go ahead and tuck the evergreens under the faux branches and tie the wire. Continue attaching the pine evergreens to the faux wreath in one direction, going all the way around. Now you can do the same step with the cypress, filling in any gaps. Attach the mini lights to the wreath, making sure to hide the wire. Add the decorative details like the birds and the gold ornaments, and don't forget the tassels too. Now, all you need is a nice fluffy bow. I love using wire ribbon because it really holds the shape of the bow. Plus, you can support the battery-powered transformer on the back of the wreath as well. Next, just hang your gorgeous wreath on your door. Look at how beautifully the greens and golds pop against the deep blue color of my front door. Just a few of those real evergreen stems adds this nice fresh scent every time you walk into the house and I just find it really restorative and calming. Oh, and it smells so good. So I hope you can see that if we just went with the faux evergreen wreath, it would kind of fall flat. So by adding just a few different kinds of textures, it really pumps up the volume and it looks layered and textured. I love it. The gold metallic mini lights kind of remind me of Moroccan lanterns. They're so cute. And I think everything from the birds to the pots of gold, to even those little tassels, that just really adds a personal touch. By trying this method, you are totally set for the next year. Now, at the end of the season, you'll notice that the real evergreen stems will probably dry out. That's totally fine, just remove them. And then next year, all you have to do is buy some real fresh evergreens, and that's gonna cost you about $5. And there you go, an anthropology-inspired boho chic holiday wreath, completed in Simply Share Share fashion for a fraction of the price. If you want even more holiday inspiration, make sure to check out my holiday playlist right over here. Okay, now it's your turn. Just leave a comment below. Let me know if you like this holiday wreath. Give me a like if you love the boho chic style. Let me know how you're decorating this year. I just love hearing from you. If you wanna connect even more, you definitely need to check out my Instagram and my Facebook. I'm always doing little Insta stories and updates on the baby. And of course, subscribe and turn on the notification bell so you do not miss any of my new videos. And next week, I'm gonna be posting a really, really fun collab on Tuesday. And I know it's not my regular posting schedule, but this collab is like epic. 
I'm gonna be doing something fun with Matt Fazile from Fidel Gastro, so you don't wanna miss it. And I hope you come back every single week so that you can learn how to get things done simply. I'll see you next time.